pretty good. Hello. So I wasn't I wasn't gonna do live uh, today. But um, I was heading to the post office and all of a sudden, there's two... Oh my God, you wouldn't believe it. Here, Randy, I don't know what to do with it. I'm like 45 minutes away from the Humane Society and these two dogs, uh, they kind of followed me. But um, I can't just let them uh, stay walking around wandering around in the streets because i know they're gonna get hit so i ended up um luring them into my car i'm in the front of my uh, son's school waiting for him to finish school so <laughs> the poor babies i think they live in this neighborhood say hello doggy where is your daddy and your mommy I don't know what to do because I can't just leave them in the side of the road, you know. And good thing I have leash and water in my car. So, yeah. The poor pit. I think this is a pit bull right, right down here. Um, he's a little bit afraid and a little bit adamant to get into the car. And the poor baby was kind of panting outside uh, in the side of the street. They're, you're just walking around, both of them. So, I said, you know what? I can't just let them stay out there. I know my uh, other half's not gonna like it because we already have three dogs in the house and they're uh, they're pretty small. But um, I, I don't intend to keep these guys. Uh, I don't know if they have uh, microchips uh, in them. So what I'm gonna do is just I'm gonna keep them in the yard for now and then um, call the humane society and maybe have them picked up or um, we'll drop them off tomorrow. They're massive and they kind of stink a little. <laughs> But anyway, yeah, so I never had a big dog like this. I always have like a smaller dogs, but look at this guy. He's just this one. <laughs> he feels like this is his car. This is his house. Oh my goodness. So my car, my, my son is going to finish school in like few minutes and uh, he'll be wondering how come the car is a little stinky. Hi, how are you, Pity? Oh, poor baby. How are you doing? Look, it's raining. Finally, the rain came down, touched down in my neighborhood. And I had a barrel full of water saved up. I'm happy with that. The grass is happy. I'm wet, but I'm okay. I feel sorry for these guys. And I, I, I really doubt that they have a microchip because they only have this sad looking collars and them i'm glad they have collars though oh my goodness i know they're probably somebody's pet and you know how it is you know in hawaii what the problem here in hawaii is not too many people really believe in putting microchip on their pets unless if they're coming from um military family or people with money they are probably gonna put microchip in them and a lot of people they don't even bother to put leash I mean a collar to their pets so hi how are you you know this this big big headed guy is a little bit scary because he's he has a massive head and I, I swear to God I bet the poops are like huge yeah Okay, we're gonna go find your mommy, okay, and your daddy. It's okay, you can stay with me for a little bit. And man, they got massive fleas. The green ones, those, oh, they have fleas. My goodness. So how are you guys doing in there? Are you all all right? Well, I'm happy because the rain finally come in Hawaiian Island. Well, in Oahu. So, I'm happy about that. So I don't have to water the grass. 
My water bill went up. My water bill is actually $149.50, which usually cost me only maybe around $112 for like one month. Oh my goodness. I have gas too. Uh, my gas is only um, $30 uh, for this month. Oh my goodness. But anyway. Poor thing. Alright guys. <laughs> Alright guys. I'm going to go now. Uh, $3.99. Randy, you don't have to rub it in. I know it's cheaper there. It's expensive here. Everything has to be shipped. <laughs> all right guys you guys have a good afternoon or good morning or good night i'm signing off now my son is coming uh coming out of his uh class pretty soon so thank you so much hey john did i pronounce it right correctly john apita hi Gigi. mayong hapon sa imo Gigi, i forgot to tell you the reason why i did a quick live right now because I was walking uh, myself to the uh, post office, it's just like next to my uh, son's uh, school, and I found these two, two big giant dogs. Look! One big giant head that looks like a cabbage, and one brown dog who doesn't care. Hi puppy! It's not mine Gigi, but uh, I found them, but I'm not going to keep them because they're too massive. I'm going to go... Uh, call the Humane Society and probably have them picked up. Otherwise, we have to drop them off to Honolulu, uh, to uh, Hawaii Humane Society. All right, guys. Thank you so much. I'll take care of these puppies now. My son is coming. Thank you. Bye-bye. Yeah.